Today, we can't even imagine the state of communication and broadcasting without the help of technology. From the phones we use to the television we watch, from the cloud technology that holds our data to the satellites used to predict whether everything needs a good working knowledge of electronics and communication. Hi, I am Dr. Chandrasekhar M. Patil, Professor and Head, Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering at VVCE, Mysuru. People often have a misconception that the field of electronics and communication is a recent development, but there have been continuous innovations in the field starting way back in 1835 when the first electric telegraph was made. From innovations made out of need to innovations that make people's life easy, electronics and communication has come a long way as a branch of engineering. Owing to the encouragement the department provides to the students, many innovative projects have been successfully worked on such as Krutaka Keeli, a keyboard for the blind, a chronic kidney disease, a prediction, an app developed by a student to predict kidney disease. Due to the ever-evolving nature of the industry, there is a need for the students to be equipped with industry knowledge amidst the duration of the course. To help with that, we have an industry supported labs such as a VLSL lab with a cadence tool which is supported by a Vivartan technology as well as Larsen and Tarbo Mysuru. And we have also Holosuit which supports uh, robotics, sand logic and Vemostra for the drone technology. The futuristic infrastructure of our labs and the expertise of our faculty enables us not only to train our students but employees of the said companies. We have a 90% placement out of which 30 to 40% is within a core companies and a highest placement package of 33 lakhs per annum this year. Due to the varied applications of semiconductors, we envision many semiconductor companies to set up a base in India as well as Mysuru, which will further increase the demand for the skilled engineers in this domain. Furthermore, we have now introduced NEP so students can pick minor subjects such as in the field of VLSI domain, robotics domain and drone technology to further increase their prospectors for placements. In order to help students break out of the monotony of academia and technology, we run literature and cultural clubs called book ads that help students develop interest in literature and creativity. Come, be a part of whole new world.